Hey, what's up you guys? My name is Buck Parker. I am a board certified general surgeon. And in this video, we're gonna talk about when the appendix bursts or perforates or breaks open or whatever you wanna call it. So why does the appendix burst? Well, first let's talk about what the appendix is. I know I have a lot of other videos about the appendix, but if you're not really quite clear, the appendix is a uh, blind ending pouch or a tubular structure. It's almost like a test tube. It's got one end is open and one end is closed. The one end is open that is, is open to the colon. The colon is the, also called, called the large bowel. Now, it really doesn't have a function, we don't think, in adulthood, but it can get blocked. And so if you imagine if you, if you stop up that test tube, okay, and then maybe before you stopped it off, you put some coke and uh, what are those pop rocks? You put the coke in the pop, pop rocks in the test tube and then you put the cap on it, right? What's gonna happen? That, that test tube is probably gonna explode at some point. And that's the same thing that happens with the appendix. Why does the appendix burst? Because generally in appendicitis, the uh, one end that's open gets blocked and it gets blocked by food or what we call fecal lists or a stone in the colon. When does the appendix burst? That generally takes a little while. Uh, so this typically happens in kids or older adults and because uh, each of those ends, they can't really tell us or they're not very communicative to us uh, to, as adults, right? If you have a kid, sometimes if they're two, they can't, talk, they can't speak very well or they can't show you or tell you what exactly is going on with their belly, they just hurt. And so, uh, like if you're a 15 year old, you're like, my belly hurts and it's right there, you know, kind of thing. And so we go into the, we go into the uh, hospital or doc, see the doctor a little faster because the parents are like, oh my God, that's, I think that's appendicitis. But as a kid or an adult, if the older adults, honestly, they just don't feel as much. Like, you know, things wear out when you get older and so does the pain uh, perception. And so older adults just don't have that pain. They think, well, I have a little belly ache, but it's not that bad. Uh, don't worry about it. I'm gonna wait on it. So typically it takes more than about 72 hours for the appendix to burst once you get appendicitis. So if you start having belly pain, when that belly pain starts uh, to when it bursts, it's gonna be more than 72 hours. Now, that's an approximation. It's really not a hard and fast rule. It could be five days, it could be seven days. Uh, you know, everybody's a little bit different. So, but that's generally what I, what I uh, use as a guideline, let's put it that way. What happens when the appendix bursts? Now, this is really actually very dangerous. So, the appendix has stool in it, and if it bursts, then that stool and bacteria gets out into the rest of the abdomen. And what happens in the abdomen is the, the lining of the abdomen uh, really, uh, is very um, uh, active in pulling water and stuff out of the abdomen, okay? And what it does is it pulls it into the blood. So if you have bacteria and stool in the abdomen, that lining is gonna pull it out into the blood and you're gonna get bacteria in the blood and bacteria in the blood, you'll get super sick. That's called sepsis. So we have this whole uh, cytokine mediated um, response and it's just, just like, just like when you smash your thumb, it swells up. Well, that's what happens in the bloodstream, but if it goes systemic, where we talk about the entire body, then the entire body blows up. Okay, or it gets, or swells up, what we say, and you can get really, really sick from that. That's why everybody talks about, is the appendix burst yet, or did it burst, or what's going on? So you don't want it to burst, because if it does, you're at risk for uh, bacteria in the blood, and sepsis, and some people even die from that. And in fact, I believe, I believe Houdini, I, I think the story is that Houdini died from appendicitis because they thought it was something else. So that's pretty much the spiel on when the appendix bursts and how it bursts and why uh, we're concerned about it. So if you like this video and you like my other videos, you should go ahead and subscribe to my channel because I'll send you more. And uh, if you can share this with a friend or like the video, that would be awesome too. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.